take 492 welcome back to my workspace I'm sure you're familiar with me by now um, this is a webcam I'm actually using it's not particularly broadcast quality the picture quality is not brilliant from it um, and neither is the sound so if you can hear me spluttering and splattering like uh, on top of i uh, i notes like um, earlier on when you're listening to the organ playing in one of the other clips um, you could probably hear that um, the pitch of the note right at the end just just breaking up it's not actually the organ it's actually the um, the microphone or the recording software that I'm actually using anyway back to why I'm here sorry about me wobbling I'm actually holding the webcam so uh, you have to bear up with me on that one anyway excuse the motorcycle going past my workshop is very close to one of the main roads I'm afraid and there's no point in me re-recording because I'll just do it again anyway this here is the John Whale board. Um, I'm sure most of you people are actually familiar with this board now. Uh, this is the old 32 note one. Um, perfect little um, board for the job. Uh, now been superseded by a new board. I uh, can't remember the number offhand, but um, I'm sure John Whale will uh, um, put that right for you. That's um, JW Omega um, Electronics, who actually produced this board. Uh, I refer to him as John Whale because that's his name. Anyway, um, very nice for the machine. Uh, I actually blew it up once. Uh, in fact, I actually blew it up twice. Um, I've obviously got a couple of rogue ma um, pallet magnets in there, hence the reason for the new board. This board here that I'm pointing at now is my own design, my own build, um, and each output is capable of a 2 amp load. One wouldn't expect to run all those at the same time, obviously, because the power supply couldn't cope with it, which is over there. Um, because the power supply is only six, uh, six amp with an eight amp surge. I am going to upgrade that actually to a uh, ten amp, twelve amp surge. Um, anyway, back to the board. We've got uh, five LEDs on this: three green, two red. I've not switched it on. I should have done so you could see them lift up. But here we go. Anyway, that one there, uh, that LED, that indicates me twelve volt rails on. Um, that one there indicates me twenty four volt rails on. Uh, the three green ones at the back, uh, let me know the common output rails are on. That one there that I'm pointing at at the moment tells me the right hand wind chest common rail is on. That's the left hand common rail for the left hand wind chest is on. And that's for the um, melody section, which is actually obviously in the middle uh, of this particular organ. Anyway, I think that's about it all done um, on that board. Anybody wanting that design, it's not built on breadboard. It is a board that I've actually designed and etched. Anybody wants a copy of it, just give me a shout and I'll send you a copy. Sorry about this camera. It's, uh, same as I've said, it's only a webcam and it switches in and out like yo-yo. Um, right, we're now... I'm trying to get that a bit better for you. Switch it the other way. Right, this is the power supply to built and designed for it. Again, my own design. Using 2 Encro 55 5 um, it's actually running on its limit at the moment and that's why I'm considering upgrading it to a 12 amp power supply um, basically what we've got is a 24 volt output rail which is that one and we've got a 12 volt output rail which is there that runs the 12 volt that is just to run the John Whale board and nothing else so it don't get no interference from nowhere else and the rest runs the rest of the circuit board I think that virtually sums up the electronics in it um, a couple of bit of wire and tidies I've got to do on it, but nothing mega on it now. Um, but anyway, thanks for viewing, and we'll talk soon.